My name's Elizabeth Harron. It's the 8th of November 2013 and I'm about to attend the PMI Synergy Conference here in London. To give you an idea of where we are in central London, we've got Westminster Abbey on this side of the street and just across the road is the Central Hall Westminster, which is where the conference is going to be held today. So let's go inside. We've just come back from morning tea break, and this morning we heard Mark Langley, the CEO and President of PMI, talk about the talent gap and the positions that will be available in project management that there are no people to uh, fill. That was a very interesting presentation. And then we had a presentation from um, Jim Lawless, who was bet one day that he couldn't become a jockey within a year. Uh, he would bet a pound by a salesperson at a conference and uh, he took that challenge and he's given us a very interesting presentation about how he overcame the challenges of, uh, of that challenge and, uh, and went on to run in and perform in a race. So he had some really good interesting things to say, it was very inspirational and had us all up on our seats practicing the positions for riding a horse. Um, so let's go back in now and uh, we'll see who we've got next. This is the hall that we're in. There are about 750 people here today, both downstairs and sitting up on the balcony, although a lot of people are out at tea break at the moment. One of the benefits of coming to an event like this is the chance to get to meet different people. And I've just, we've just had the lunch break, and as you might be able to hear them clearing away. And I spent lunch time with a guy from the PMI France chapter he was telling me about a three-year project that they've been working on to put all the different chapters in France together to merge into one big national chapter. And it sounded like a really interesting piece of work. And now he's vice president, one of the vice presidents of the France chapter. Um, and they're talking about it at several different uh, conferences because it is such a big piece of work. It took three years to plan. Um, and the amount of effort and coordination and stakeholder management involved in that was really quite interesting. So it's good to be able... And he's not presenting here. It was just interesting to be able to bump into different people, which is not something that you'd get when you meet people virtually online through virtual conferences. So it's a bit of a perk of coming to a face-to-face -face event like this one. Well, the conference is just wrapping up now. It's been a really interesting afternoon. We've just heard James Brown speak um, about his experiences working at NASA, which was a really, really interesting. Um, there was a good speaker as well, Steve, Stephen Carver, just before him, who was talking about whether the Olympics was a success or a failure. Very interesting to see that different people have different perceptions and that perceptions can change over time. What starts off as a failure, like the Millennium Dome, can then turn into a success when that was rebadged as the O2. So it's been a really good day and I think um, there's been a lot of takeaway messages that we can learn from what's happened um, and the different people's experiences that have been shared. I hope that gives you a flavour of the day of what it was like to attend PMI Synergy Conference this year. I wasn't able to video any of the presentations by the speakers themselves, but I will be writing up some of the key messages and the key ideas I took away from the speakers on my blog, so you'll be able to read more about it there.